welcome to the video gentlemen and uh, in this video i am going to show you guys that how you can skip logout confirmation of a woocommerce website uh, let me just show you around that what i am actually talking about whenever you are logged in or maybe your client maybe your customer is logged in to the into his account of woocommerce whenever he will click on something like logout button he just sees a log out confirmation that uh, if he really wants to log out or not just like this so a lot of people find it frustrating and uh, there's no point of asking maybe maybe you are say, maybe you find it, your maybe your client your clients your buyers uh, they might find this thing very frustrating and you might want to get rid of it so in the in today's video i'm just showing you guys i'm just going to uh, show you the actual way of doing it by uh, by using php i'm going to handle it programmatically i'm just going to uh, give you a code snippet that you can install in that you can add into your website and uh, it will be working perfectly let me just show you what what i want you to do you, you can just follow me along to, through the, through this video and uh, your uh, website will have that feature in, in it just log into your website and uh, uh, try to install a plugin plugin the name of that plugin is code snippet basically you can do this in two ways number one is using code snippet plugin to inject uh, your code into functions.php file or the other you can just uh, open functions.php file by using file manager or maybe ftp and you can just uh, paste down that code over there if you if you're going to use the code snippet plugin just uh, search in for snippet uh, this is the plugin that we need to install code snippet by code snippet pro you just need to you just need to have a, uh, install it and activate it once you activated it you will see something um, like this snippets click on add new snippet and just for the instance give it uh, some kind of names uh, let me just give it skip confirmation so the uh, the code that we need to paste in over here is this code. Uh, it's if if you are if you are a programmer, this 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 might seem uh, a little little bit uh, easy to you. You can just uh, read it once and you can understand it. If you are not a tag guy, I'm just uh, assuming that you are not a tag guy, so there's no point in explaining all of this stuff. It will just work uh, perfectly. You just need to paste it over here and. Uh, it, it will be it will be uh, uh, it will be selected by default and code snippet everywhere and you can just change it if you change it if you want to I'm gonna leave it right over here run code snippet everywhere and save changes and activate it and once it is activated let me just uh, show you that if is it working or not okay so code snippet added and activated let me just show you just uh, to make sure that code is being applied on the website let me just refresh the website for once and once it is refreshed, let me just click on this logout button and hopefully it will automatically. Okay, as you can see, as you can see that uh, the website is successfully logged out. It is, it, it does not say any kind of like, it does not ask for any sort of uh, confirmation. So th th this, th this seems to be very useful for, uh, for most of the, most of the people. And if you wanted to, if, if you are some sort of like into WooCommerce business, this, this thing, uh, 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 seems to be very very good and very um, very good for your customers uh, for their user experience on your website so this will be it for the web uh, for the today's video and uh, if you like the video please like it and uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that and uh, click on that bell icon to get notified whenever i upload a new video and uh, and if you want to know that way you can find that code and where i'm going to uh, uh, give the link uh, to my article that I'm going to write within a day or maybe two uh, and that that article on my website will be having that code snippet in it you can just uh, you can just copy that from there and uh, and if you if you don't want to copy that and if, if you are watching the video before I uploaded that uh, article on my website you can just uh, you can just uh, write it down from the video that I just showed you basically this is the code that you want to write you can just skip all this part this is just this is just a, a comment section you can just write this uh, write this code into your uh, functions.php file or code snippet and it will work seamlessly so thank you so much for watching and uh, take care goodbye